So, some thoughts on preparedness. Um, we all have a, it's not a survival skill, but this is a preparedness thing, right? Well, like, uh, the power goes out, I got this or that or the other thing. So, I've got a wood stove, we've got heat. What if the power goes out? You've got that wood stove and you're stoking it up and you're chopping wood. And the next thing you know, you cut your hand. Really bad. And it's been like a week in the, the major ice storm. That's not going to work. It's not going to work at all. Got to have power for that to work. Now, if you have a battery backup, it may work for a little while. But uh, not very long. You have one of these? It's a foam. old-fashioned phone probably five bucks ten bucks new um, probably a dollar at a garage sale don't have to leave it hooked up just unplug the base here other one plug it into this think about it how prepared are you if you can't call for help I mean it's not you know critical in some state you know some if you're not cutting your arm off or something, it's not very critical. But uh, if you got a fire, you know, the fire department may still be working. Just because the neighborhood's power is out. Your cell phone's dead. This hasn't worked for a week, two days, whatever. Think about it, guys. Five bucks, ten bucks, dollar, you know, whatever. Doesn't have to be a good phone, just has to work. It'll be the crappiest one you got. It's been uh, Brian from Moment to Ponder. Check out the uh, blog uh, right up, right up there. Subscribe down there. Uh, ooh, it's really hard to do when you're looking the wrong way. Uh, down here is the thumbs up stuff, comments up this way. This way. Subscribe. Up there. Yeah. Alright. <clears throat> uh, and go to the website. www.momentponder.com And check out the, uh, the podcast.